reached the voice mailbox of you can leave a message after the tone. When you're finished, press the number sign or just hang up. All right, so I want to start off by saying that I have no strong opinion of Euphoria either way. I've enjoyed the visual richness and the solid performances and have been critical of his excess. But Sunday, as I rewatched the entire series, I noticed how I responded to it. As I watched Ruby truly awful to her family, for some reason the image of Frank Gallagher came into my head. Only, despite the two sharing the same desperate condition, I didn't feel repulsed. I felt sad. I noted this because it made me question myself. And it made me ask, Why is Frank a villain and not Rue? I wondered if other people were having a similar experience, so I went online to see how people were reacting. I realized that my peers were largely in the same boat as me. Hesitant to judge, quick to justify. For 18 episodes, we've watched Rue Bennett and her peers navigate some very adult shit. And through it all, we've given them grace, even it, because we know where they're coming from. We adults, and with a TV Emmy rating, the series is for legal adults, have bonded with these kids. As a result, we never see them pass that label. So no matter their actions, nothing they say or do makes it out of the realm of troubled teen. Every conflict and situation that has happened in the series happens in adult life. But I wonder, if they were in their 30s, would we be quick to compassion or would our impulse be to vilify them? There are grown men shaped by complex childhoods like Nate who still act like him. Women who navigate relationships with the same fear of abandonment and need for validation as Cassie. And adults with diagnosed and undiagnosed mental disorders and emotional trauma that use substances to cope like Rue. What would our reaction be to them? I'm asking this question keeping in mind the stigma attached to addiction and mental health the harmful ideas around womanhood and manhood and the general lack of humanity that is pervasive in our societies. So I return to Frank and Rue. What makes her easier to embrace? Is it her youth? Does it absolve her of severity? Do young bodies lessen the gravity of these issues? Does youth provide enough distance for us to confront these issues with the grace and sympathy that they deserve? If that's the case, what does that say about us?